start with how did you meet Black China? Let's start there. Um, she DM'd me. She she DM'd you. She DM'd you. Yeah, yeah. She was like, you in LA? I said, I put the pound sign, the hashtag. Like, I don't do DMs. She was like, wait, the line. Check the line. It's, it's in that jack. line. Yeah. It's in that line. There's nothing else to talk about. She DM'd you just like out of nowhere, or y'all had some sort of LA. That's it. That's all. Wow. Oh, when was this? This was like uh, two and a half months ago. Oh, so y'all recently, y'all just met? Yeah. You got the drawers that fast? It right. wasn't nothing like that, man. You know, I just got persona, I man. I got persona. You got persona. <laughs> <laughs> he's a cutie, ladies. I'm looking at him. He he got that swag. He's he's an attractive guy. So yeah. she sent the number, though, right? And then No, he said, you said. She told me, she said, I said, send the number. She was like, you send yours. I send my number. Next thing I know, I get a FaceTime. She was trying to see if I was catfish or not. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. So she FaceTimed me. I seen I'm like, oh, okay, what's up? Next day, she called me. And it went on from there. I never check my DMs. I gotta start checking my DMs. I gotta start checking my DMs. Like, I, I, I wonder who's like, it happens that fast. Michael Jordan. Really? You gotta, you gotta put your jersey on. Really? I don't check my DMs. Why me? Face to face and don't check these. So look, y'all connect in Vegas. When when she reaches out to you and obviously you guys meet up, um, what's the initial thing? Like, is it just on some smash time or? Nah, nah, it wasn't even that. We was just getting to know each other. At first, we got into it because she was like, nah, you're not getting too bougie for me. I was just like, look, man, black China, white China, Mexican China, it don't matter. You're still a female to me. I'm from the city, you know? So um, we got into it. We beefed out. And then she called me back like, why you act like that? I'm like, what you mean? She's like, you just act like it ain't that. I'm just like, look, whatever. You weren't sweating. I wasn't sweating. I that. wasn't sweating. She wasn't used to so that. So I think, but I think that's what drew her in even more. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Because yeah. we aggressive, you know? We pull up and we, we show out. That's what we do. So how long before you smash? Uh, <laughs> that's what I wanted to know too, Kai. I wanted to know. For real? Um, it was the first time. As soon as I got out there. So you, That's what I'm talking about. So what is that? So you met, like, so within a week? We met. We met. I flew out there, like, uh, I want to say about a week and a half later. So the we fr- kicked it. Yeah, we kicked it. We popped some rosé. We chilled. Listened to little candles. We kicked it. Watched a movie in a movie room. And, you know, I got a little aggressive. And things go down when you get aggressive. She a gold medalist. Man, shorty a winner. I guess she's a winner. She's a winner. She, she, she handles all the, the parallel balls. Yo, she yo, does it all. She's Bomber a horse. winner. Yes, man. absolutely. You all see right. why people is freaking out. Floor routine. Uh, uh, uh. 107.5 GCI. This is number one for hip-hop and... I'm just like, oh, man, I know it ain't that big. So yesterday I flew in, and uh, everybody who's on the plane just looking. I'm just like, uh, Trying to figure it out. Trying yeah. to figure it out. Even the person I was next to, she was like, is this you? <laughs> like, yeah, that's me. So you got to get, you know, let, let, so let's let's break it down. So you were dating Black China. I wasn't dating. You wasn't dating. Okay, so you were just. Just well, smashing. You know, just, just, just Hanging dating. out. Just persona dripping. Okay. <laughs> Details, true or false? That's false. You didn't That's reach false. out to Rob Kardashian? No, what happened was um, my child's mother, they had a little conflict going on her and Rob. <laughs> I think it's because a lot of people was hurt after the situation, you know, because me and her was just a little blunt to the situation. They both knew, you know what I'm saying? But um, I think I had hit Rob, I was like, yo, you looking for me? Because he hit my baby mother trying to get my number. And my baby mother like, I'm not going to give it to you. So she sent it, you know, she had it inside the little DM. So I hit him like, you looking for me? He like, who this is? I'm like, come on, man, you know, come on, don't, don't, don't act funny. Right. And so um, he picked up, we talked, we FaceTimed, we had a full conversation. He like, yo, next time you out here, you know, let's get up. You know what I'm saying? You seem like a cool dude, whatever, this and that. But honestly, it's deeper than what people think. They don't really know what's really going on with the money situation. So since we here on 107.5 WGCI, right. um, it was a proposition made. Exclusive. Exclusive. Yeah. Okay. It was a proposition made, you know what I'm saying? He promised a million plus tax free. So in order to put hey, hey, wait, hey, wait, let me hey, it. hey, that's exclusive. Wait, Listen, a, no, a nobody million for what this. though? Man, you know, hey man. <laughs> people people looked around, I say, look, dude, your woman loves you, man. She likes you. Cause I never told him I smashed. I never told him that. I just kept it honest. I'm just like, no, nah, we FaceTimed a few times. You know, because I didn't know his delivery. 
I don't know. You know, I don't know who playing for the game. Just me being right. real from the city. Right. So I'm not gonna give you the game, and then you go tell and say this with this guy telling me. Right. Nah. So nah. Everything was cool. We was we was chilling. That's it. So you never linked with him. Never been to a house. Nope. I ain't done nothing. I so you lied. Him. Yeah, I lied to him. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And just like I thought, he came out shooting black bullets. Right. You know. What I'm I, I, I want to be clear. So he offered you a million dollars to go or what? He offered me five hundred first, and I was like, man, stop it, man. I done ran through that myself. He's like, well, just know we got a million plus tax free. And I'm like, woo, okay. Wow. I'm on the way to LA, baby. <laughs> <laughs> what about the story that you and your girlfriend, your actual girlfriend, or baby mom, I'm not sure your status, yeah. were you using China and Rob just to get paid from yourself for yourself? Nah, that's that's definitely not true. Honestly, um, me and my baby mother, we you know, we growing, we co parenting right now, and you know what I'm saying? At first it was hectic. I sent her the message in terms of just trying to get her to ease off of because I know how she is. If I just flew out there and linked up with her, she'd have been looking at me crazy. And just to protect my relationship with my child's mother, I had to say something. So I had to just put a lot of finesse. That's why the mixtape called Sorry I Said. So, so is, it, is, it, is, it, is it safe to say that you think Rob is a simp? Um, Real honest, just talking. Is Rob a simp? And like, I, feel like, I, feel like, I feel like Rob is a good dude, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, he just needs to learn how to keep his feelings in his pocket. You know what I'm saying? Business is business. Emotion is emotion. And you can't combine, you can't combine them two. You can't well, you said business is business. He wasn't looking at Black China as business. That's his right. child's mother. So how, where do you get the business yeah, part for that? Was, believe me, he was looking at that business because things that he told me, you know what I'm saying, I don't really want to recap. But at the same time, it's just like, dude was going down and bounce. And right. I'm looking at it like this. I basically gave him the game. Like, look, dude, I'm going to be here. You know what I'm saying? So either... You paying our late, or we both paying our late. <laughs> and I just I got a question. Why not walk away for a million dollars? Nah, my jeopardy is a little bigger than that. I, I'm a mogul. I'm one of the youngest moguls alive. I'm not even finna settle for that. Like, regardless, a million dollars? Come on, man. So, we got to take a break into this song. When we come back, I kind of want to ask you a couple of things. I want to know what it is you were doing already before. Because right. uh, Rogers, we got uh, Ferrari in the studio right now. Been hanging out with us, being very open and honest about what he's going through. Black China and uh, Rob Kardashian. Dropping yeah. jewels. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dropping yeah. jewels. He's tall. He's a cutie. I can see how he probably laid it down and made this whole thing crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I can see it. He's attractive. You know what that means? You can see that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But no, oh, 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 the hell up. Right, right. Y'all know what I was trying to spot. I was trying to be descriptive. I was trying to be descriptive for the radio. All right, let me ask you. What you saying, girl? I want to ask you a serious question because. When we talk about drama, we talk about hey. being involved in situations like what's going on between Black Child and Ryan and, uh, China. What? Black Rob and Ryan. Okay. <laughs> Black Child. 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 Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, you, people do you, crazy you, stuff you like that. You to be honest? Yeah. I'm from Chicago. That answers it, right? Ooh, He's a sympathizer. Don't really care. Hey, man, oh, that's savage, his problem. Man. Savage, man. That ain't got nothing to do with me, man. Okay. You, you stirred up everything in the blender that you asked for. So you wouldn't feel any responsibility, though? Um, Rob's a good guy. <laughs> you don't think he was manipulated? Like, you know, like, you don't think Black China... Okay, well, let's go back to the beginning. You know, Black China now has a lawyer, and she's saying that she really did love him. Do you think she was once really in love with Rob Kardashian? Yeah, I really do think that. And she honestly told me that herself. Okay. Yeah, she told me that. When all the Instagrams were coming out, you were with Black China, correct? Um, when, when Rob Kardashian went on his Instagram, um, or were you not with her that? The day before. The day before? Yeah. Okay. The robe. Why are you wearing Rob's clothes? Y'all gonna keep saying these man, this man clothes. That was my role. That was your role? Yeah, listen. Or Al Sharpton's. <laughs> For real. You know, that's like, nice. everybody's bro. Right. But but honestly, um, she had FaceTime me like days before that when I was in Atlanta. She like, babe, I got you something. I'm like, oh, what is it? She like, I got us some robes. I'm like, all right, cool. So when I got there, I pulled up to the spot. The robe was brand new in the box with the tags. No Rob Juice or nothing on it. Nah, Rob Nothing, juice. nothing on it. You know what I'm saying? I unwrapped it myself, took the plastic, took the receipts off, and I threw it on. And she threw hers on, and we was just kicking it. So I was laying in bed. She like, you want some breakfast? I'm like, yeah. I usually get breakfast in bed. That's what she do. She order Postmates. We get breakfast. We kicking it. 
I'm like, oh man, this is a really nice robe. I really like this robe. And the new Versace sheets, I'm kicking it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm just kicking it for real. The light. 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 You know what's so funny? The picture that went viral, she was actually next to me when I took the picture. I told her, like, babe, hop in the picture. And she was like, nah, what you trying to do? And I was like, wait, what? I'm like, man, whatever. I took the picture, right? Yeah. And I just laid back and called it one. Yeah. So the picture really wasn't even intended on shooting no shots at nobody else arrived. It was really shooting shots at her because when we got into it, I was like, man, the caption said Medusa was a snake. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And I'm really talking about, you know, Bobby being in the Versace, with the Versace sheets, and then Medusa. But it's subliminal, though. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, a subliminal. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it's subliminal. towards that. On some rapper. Yeah, subliminal. so that was my role, man. That, that role, man, yeah, come on. That's Rob. not Rob Kardashian's role. No way. Never was Rob's role. Have you ever wore his clothes while you were at Black, Black China's house? Rob is 260. I'm 210. Dude, I don't, I don't <laughs> so, Okay, so, so you don't care that this woman's been linked with all these men in the same He's week? He's not dating. Man, you ain't getting what I'm saying. It's persona, man. You don't never pay attention to that. If you see it, just act like you don't see it. You're going to win in the end. He is you know what? Ferrari to the builders and cool. a thousand females just pulled over like, I'm about to sell. <laughs> so let's talk about the aftermath and what's going on right now. We know um, Black China was on Good Morning America. She has a lawyer. She won a restraining order against Rob Kardashian, and he can no longer post any photos of her online. And I was told that you received a letter as well, too. I did. What did your letter say? You can't post anymore? Yeah, same thing, probably, to the same extent. So, but um, the lawyer hit me up, like two or three of them. Then when the group chat, and I read it, and I was like, what? So, you know me? I sent back, yeah, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> so are you, so have you, when's the last time you talked to Black China? We ain't really been talking. Um, last time we talked, I was leaving the jewelry store, and um, she sent me some screenshots, and I was just like, what is this for? And I went off on a rant on um, text messages, she never responded. I was like, okay, I know what that means. All right, cool, peace. So y'all not on good terms at the moment? No, I don't think so. I don't really know, honestly. You know, with communication, she has a thing of going to her little hut and, you know, staying in there for a minute until she feel like coming out. Right. right. So I don't really know. She may come out with a whole new attitude. She's just different like that. She got, like, eight different personalities. But you said you like, okay, we we're talking off the mic, and Kyle said, do you think you could really fall in love with her? You like her a lot. Yeah. But it, and say what you like about her. You said that you like the fact that she came from nothing. and True. And I just like the way she put things, you know what I'm saying? Like, China's lonely. To what I said, like, I mean, there's a lot of guys that would love to be with her, don't get me wrong. But um, everybody around her, you know, is strategically there for a situation, you know what I'm saying? And um, I just think she just, she ambitious, she grinded, she super grinded. I'm from a city that, you know, you got to make something out of nothing. So I just seen a lot of her that I seen that I had going on, my mother had going on, and just everybody around me. Like, it's a, the, 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 the typical situation when it comes to blacks, I'm just being honest. Right. You know what I'm saying? But for to go that far, you, you got the crown giving it to you like huh you know because you think so you you applaud her for getting to where she is yeah i applaud her that's finesse you ain't heard my mixtape <laughs> <That's finesse. laughs> we're gonna get into all of that too yeah 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 but what's so with that being said like what's the ultimate goal now at this point like you know what i'm saying for her and for you um i really don't know the goal i really don't know the goal for her i know the goal for me is now that i have a, a say so a word a say so a word with the city and the people around me and the young youth i'm finna attack it one of the youngest, one of the youngest moguls alive. I'm finna have a water coming out called I Life H2O. Since Ferrari did this interview with this radio station, Black China has banned him from coming to any of her events that she has coming up, especially the one that's going to be in Atlanta that's coming really soon because that's where he's from. So he's going to be in Atlanta and she doesn't want to have anything to do with him since he's going around publicizing their relationship. Black China basically feels like what they had is now done and he, he just needs to stop talking about it. Um, if he's not careful, he will be sitting in court being sued just like Rob Kardashian. But anyways, thanks for tuning in and I'll catch you guys later. Bye.